Hello everyone, this is Afra from Quick WordPress Websites. In this video, we'll see how to create a blog post using WordPress Gutenberg or Blog Editor. So you can see once you've done the post, you can see the post title and paragraphs and hyperlinks and with buttons and with rounded images and the image description and also a fixed image with the cover letters and the media with the text and subheadings with background highlighted text and another heading with cover letter and the quoted text and also you can see the image gallery and also you can see the table with the embedded video and the pdf file embedded so let's go and see how to do this let's start creating blog post using wordpress gutenberg or blog editor for that go to wordpress dashboard click posts then click add new now it will open up a following page here you can see you can add the title and you can type the contents here and also you can see on the left side the toggle block inserter tools and undo redo items in this side you can see and also you can have the save draft preview and publish and here you can see the settings wheel so here you can move to post mode or blog mode so let's keep this post mode and here you can see the visibility publish you can publish immediately or you can backdate or forward it and also you can uh, see the uh, create the url here and here post format you can change standard link quote and author you can change author for the moment only one author and here you can create any categories if you have too many categories you can search from the search categories and here you can create tags and you can put featured image and excerpt for put that is a summary of the post so like that those things you can add here so let's start by adding a title so i just type a title called 20 best places to visit in india so then you can type the first paragraph here i just copy paste one paragraph contents here you can see some items are in block letters so here you can edit that block if you want you can make them as italic so you can click this one so i make it italic so if you want to give a link give a link to this area so just click this item link item and here you can put the website link you want to give a link and you can activate this open in a new tab so when viewers click the link it will open in a new tab so let's click submit so you can see it will show it will open in a new tab so now this item have been created a uh, one block so if you want to add another paragraph or another block you can click this plus icon here you can have many items paragraph column embed youtube and other things if you want to view the full items you can click browse you can see the full items like paragraph heading list code classic and other things so when you move around it will show examples for each and every item like that you can move with media gallery and audio files and other things here you can create designs by adding buttons columns groups and other things here you can embed any twitter youtube or other video audio files like that several options are there so let's add another paragraph so click paragraph okay. so i just paste you can see here i have pasted two paragraphs so in the paragraph section you can add many paragraphs without troubling into making new paragraphs for each paragraph just you can copy paste several paragraphs into one paragraph section right let's see how to add columns so click this plus icon you can select columns or you can search the column here as well so select column here you can see you can have two equal columns or one third two third columns like this or three columns like this you can create so just create this one so there are two columns so let's see how to add images into two columns so let's click this plus icon again you can search for image so I can image so here you can click image so you can upload new image or you can get from media gallery or you can insert from a url so let's upload an image 
now the image is uploaded you can move the image size you can move make it small or big and also you can add the caption to this image you can select this caption you can bold it or you can make it italic like that if you want to give a link you can click this icon and you can give the link as we done earlier similarly you can if you want to give a link to the picture you can click this picture again you can select this link and you can create link to the picture so again let's type here click plus again image you can upload another image if you want to add caption you can add caption here like that you can do if you want to edit these images you can just right click this settings icon here here you can see it is a default one so if you make it rounded one as well if you want you can do like this you can make it rounded like that you can do and also image size you can select image sizes and you can set up the width and height of the images if you want so let's click this plus icon and let's put another heading so i click heading so here i can put one heading that is agra so you can edit this heading size you can make it more bigger or you can make it smaller so i feel this is okay so again put a plus icon so you can click plus here or else you can click plus here as well both are okay let's put another paragraph when you click these three dots you can copy this block or duplicate or you can move color for background you can put any color like this or like this so let's put another heading so when click this drop cap is in the first letter of the paragraph will be capital the first letter of the paragraph will be capital like this let's see how to add a quote add text so you can click this plus icon here and you can search for quote so you can see here so here you can paste a quote i just copy paste this so if you want you can put like this or you can put a citation if you want i like it and write you can make it right like this pull quote like this so let's go for another topic and let's put an image gallery so let's click gallery so when you hover arrow above this it will show display on the right side so let's add a gallery so let's upload some multiple images you can see the image gallery here in the gallery by default it is appear as three columns like this so if you want to change this column options click this settings here here you can change this thumbnail or medium size so when you click the select gallery you can here you can see the columns on the right side also you can see the columns so you can move like this you can create four columns like this you can see or else you can create two columns like this so let's keep it three so like this you can change the column option as well if you want to add the image with the text on the left and right just click this plus and search for media and text so you can have here it will show you how it will appear like this so click media and text so here you can upload the image on the right side you can paste the contents like this you can paste and if you want to highlight this one and so in between let's put a cover image go to cover you can see when you give cover you can write in the in image like this you can write on the email like varanasi you can change the text color like white like this you can put images so in this block you can click in the right side you can see you can change the appearance so you can move the focal point and if you click fixed background when you move the image will be fixed you can see the image is fixed if you want to put some overlay you can put some overlay on the image okay before moving into next step let's delete some previous block 
so let's go back and if you want to delete this paragraph just click on that here select this options and here go down and click remove paragraph now that paragraph have been removed now if you want to keep a same sentence in different places for example if you want to keep this sentence repeatedly keep this paragraph repeatedly in other sections you can make it as a reusable one this go click here and go down you can click reusable block so click create reusable block and click reusable one and you can give a name as trip so let's save so now go down and click plus and you can use the same reusable block here so click reusable so you have created a reusable block called trip so you can click to add this trip here also you can edit this reusable block by manage reusable block okay let's go down and click the re reusable and click this trip so now the same paragraph coming to the other area so rather than copy and pasting you can just use the reusable item as this let's see how to add a button and hyperlink to that button so let's click plus and here you can select for button so here the button is there okay when you click this settings side you can see the button settings so you can have fill or you can have this outline and with settings you can have like this and the radius you can put change the radius of the button so let's put some text so let's minimize this and click this color section you can click this test color and you can keep this white or yellow other colors so let's keep it white and you can change the background color so background color you can use one color or gradient so if you want to use one color you can just put one color like this or like this or like this if you want to have a gradient color you can select this gradient one and you can put like this gradient and if you want to keep the button in the center of the array in the middle you can turn in the center and if you want to give a hyperlink to the video so let's click this you can select this hyperlink so i select so i given my youtube channel link so click open tap in a new tab and just enter let's see how to add a table so click this plus icon search for table so you can select the number of column and the rows so you can see the table is created so if you want you can add it insert row above like excel sheet you can add or delete the rows columns and other things and let's put some contents here and you can click this icon here you can see uh, create the strips and you can create the fixed width header section and if you want we can create a footer section here and let's see how to embed a video again click this plus icon here you can go to your youtube video let's em embed a youtube video so here you can put the uh, youtube video url i just go to my youtube channel and create and copy this link so copy this link address and just paste here and click embed now you can see the video is embedded so let's see how to embed a pdf file so again click this plus and go here search for file so just select file so here click upload i select one pdf file and click open now you can give a file name for that so i give over one file name journey through india you can see now the pdf file is inserted viewers can scroll here and also they can select pages they want and also they can maximize and minimize and they can download and print all the things can be done so once you're done editing your your post before publishing you have to complete the other things you can select any category so if you want to put some categories you can select any categories from here or else you can create a new category so let's create a new category called nature once click enter it will be added so nature already selected so if you want you can add edit data speak or other things you can put and also you can put some tags the tags are useful for search engine optimization like that you can put feature uh, tags and also you can put a featured image so let's select featured image so if you want to put this as a featured image you can select and set as the features image okay once all the things done click publish so now you can view the post so click view post wow now you can see the edited picture in nature two categories the post is published here and you can see the button and the images rounded images at the fixed image and the media with text and other highlighted text here and highlighted code here an image gallery table embedded youtube video and the pdf file 
So all the things are here. And then finally, you can see the tags here. So more videos, please subscribe our channel and stay with us. Thank you.